Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading. Uh, what do they want from you? This is going to be for Virgo. I uh, will find this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for June 2022. So um, we're going to take a look at someone that's recently coming back into your life, or it could be someone that you're currently dealing with that's not making their intentions and feeling known towards you. So we're going to take a look at what this person wants from you, and then we'll finish off the read to see what will happen if you allowed this person back into your life, or if you continued on with this person. So apply this to your own unique situation keep in mind that these are general messages so take what resonates and leave the rest behind if this uh, message didn't resonate with you take a look at your other placements if you guys haven't done so yet uh hit the subscription button and the notification bell so that you guys get notified when, when my new videos post give this video a thumbs up like this video share this video leave a comment down in the comment section below if this message resonates um Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective uh, Virgo people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. So if you're looking for a reading that's specific to your uh, energies, to your unique situation, I suggest you book a private personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. All right, Virgo, let's get started. Tell me about Virgo here, the person that's coming back into Virgo's life or the person that Virgo is dealing with here. What does this person want from Virgo? What does this person want from Virgo? What does this person want from Virgo for June 2022? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Virgo. Yeah, Page of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Energy. Seems like this person wants to chat. Seems like this person has an offer for you, offer of, of uh, commitment here. Could be dealing with another Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, or Virgo. All right, Three of Pentacles. Seems like someone here wants to work together here with you. They want to be on the same page here with you if you guys were not on the same page, okay? With that Three of Pentacles, that also could be an indication that, you know, you might be starting a new project here with somebody, okay, regarding your work, all right? Uh, we have the Moon here, Cancer, Pisces Energy. We have the Knight of Swords, Labor, Aquarius, Gemini. Seems like someone here is rushing in to reveal a secret to you, to tell you some sort of truth, something that they've been keeping from you. Could be dealing with the Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, with the Knight of Swords, with the Eight of Swords here, and Judgment, Sagittarius Energy. You know, I feel like this person's paranoid that, you know, the secret is going to come out on its own, which usually does when you keep a secret. You can't keep a secret hidden for a long time, okay? And, you know, the, you know, always have a way of coming up to the surface, you know, uh, that's part of the uh, natural laws of, of the universe, okay? So the Eight of Swords and the Judgment card here. Yeah, because it's all about balance, and when you keep a secret, when you have a secret, it creates an imbalance, and then it naturally uh, balances that, uh, balances that uh, out, yeah? So uh, Judgment, Sagittarius energy here. Someone here is paranoid or fearful of something coming to the surface. So I feel like they're trying to come in to tell you before uh, you find out on your own. Why is uh, the Page of Pentacles here? Ten of Pentacles, wow. Ten, three of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune, okay. Seems like you're dealing with a divinely guided connection here. We have the Wheel of Fortune and the Ten of Pentacles. This is an indication if this person left you or that you separated from this individual, this person's coming back to give you everything that you've wanted, Virgo. The Moon. Sa uh, temperance. Knight of Swords, the Devil. Eight of Swords, the Knight of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Judgment and the Fool, Aries energy. We have the, uh, the Hierophant on the bottom of the deck, Taurus Energy. Okay, so Temperance, the Devil, Cap uh, Capricorn Energy. 
this is interesting because I feel like this is an individual that has instilled a lot of fears into you. I'm feeling like this person could be a bit verbally abusive here, emotionally and uh, mentally abusive. Because I'm getting a bit of a trauma bonding energy and I feel like this is someone that, you know, this is someone that has a pattern of doing this. Pulling away, coming back, pulling away, coming back, pulling away, coming back. And each time this person comes back, you give this person a chance. I feel like you're, this person's, I mean, if you haven't already figured it out, you probably already have because I feel like this person is scared that you're seeing right through their mask. And I feel like you already have. And I feel like this might have been revealed in a dream or something like that, where this person's mask falls off and then you see this person's face, their true face here, which could be, you know, an, an, an entity, okay? Uh, the Knight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and the Fool, Aries energy. It's like this person is trying to cover up what's been revealed, okay? Um, let's see what else we have here. What will happen if Virgo allowed this person back into their life or if Virgo continued on with this individual? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for June 2022. What will happen if Virgo allowed this person back into their life or if Virgo continued on with this person? Sun, moon, rising, Venus signs for June 2022. All right, let's see. We have Justice, Libra Energy, and the Hermit. Five of Wands and the Seven of Cups. The Page of Cups and the Three of Swords. It seems like this person will break your heart again. This person has not learned their lessons. This person is going to do the exact same thing as they did before. Justice and the Hermit. This person refuses to take responsibility for their actions, refuses to introspect and self-reflect and learn. Libra Energy, Justice card, Hermit, Virgo Energy could be dealing with another, another Virgo, Five of Wands, and the Seven of Cups. Seems like this person likes to get other people involved in your connection. This person could be cheating on you or has been cheating on you, like always. Page of Cups and the Three of Swords. Seems like you're dealing with someone here who is foolish, who's immature, okay? This person could have narcissistic tendencies or something like that, all right? So, um, Virgo, you could be done with this person. But this person's not done with you. Justice. Wow. Okay. Yeah, Seven of Swords. Yeah, I, I, I just don't feel like this person really has great intentions. I, this person has never had really good intentions. Uh, the Hermit, Virgo Energy, uh, the Ace of Swords. Yeah, I just feel like you already know the truth here. Okay. Um, you know, I feel like when this person's faced with the truth, they run away. Okay. Um, so I, I just feel like nothing has ever been resolved with this individual. The Five of Wands and the Three of Cups, the Seven of Cups, and the Magician here. I do feel like this person's really manipulative. This person really distorts your reality to make you see things from their distorted point of view. Three of Cups and the Magician here, Gemini Virgo. Seems like a lot of people... This is typical narcissistic. Uh, this is a t typical uh, narcissist, I feel. Um, you know, I'm not a doctor or anything, but that's the energy that's coming up. But I feel like this person gets other people involved, you know, to sort of like vouch for your person's narrative. Page of Cups. You're the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Three of Swords. Oh. And the Eight of Cups. Yeah, it's just this person's going to do the same thing again. They're going to walk away. They're going to run away again. Yeah, so just be careful with this individual, Virgo. It seems like they're going to come back and give you what you want, tell you what you want to hear, and then do the same thing again. 
So Virgo, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Share this video, like this video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right, thanks guys. Bye.